And welcome back, guys, to another episode of Falcon Blaze RimWorld. Now, last time we left off with a fucking huge raid, like, out of proportion, that was uh, pretty much handled pretty well. Uh, we did, we did not uh, momentarily uh, lose, uh, not really lose, but one of our guys, who was it? Molina. Molina went down, not because of the enemy, but because of our own incompetence of shooting, unfortunately. So let me speed up the game here. So uh, he went down, but, you know, he's going to get, you know, healed up and whatnot. Luckily, we didn't lose him altogether. Uh, trade ships passing nearby, and they are an industrial trader, which means uh, metal for us, which is good. So, let's, uh... Right. Bruce Wayne, you don't do anything right now, but, um... Oh, actually, no, no, sorry. Bruce, I apologize. That's not your job anymore. Smith, where the fuck are you there, Smith? You go over here and handle some communications. So... Essentially, um, the things that we've uh, taken from the latest episodes, though, is that we did build the incinerator room. All of these bodies will be moved to that area, and they'll get burned eventually, instead of having nasty-ass graves in front of our uh, base. Another thing that we're going to focus on shortly is just actually cleaning all the blood from our goddamn base. It looks like, you know, hundreds of, like, thousands of gore around the fucking whole base, which is really, you know, not really pleasing to the eye. Uh, let's see. These guys are obviously going to have all the metal in the world, which we will definitely buy off of them, so give me all that. Whatever price you want to give me, go ahead and give it to me. I got all the money in the world right now, bro. So let's get this metal off of them and trade. Thank you. So they're going to have 12000 now to barter with, meaning let's go ahead and sell some weapons. So Lee Enfield, right off the bat, you get on out of here. There's a lot of weapons that we haven't picked up, as a matter of fact. So hopefully this trade ship decides to hang out for a while so that it could, um, you know, facilitate us with some selling and whatnot. The M16s are definitely going to go, though. They're down to 8000 So let's make sure that we are maximizing what we could sell here. Pistols, definitely one of the things we want to get rid of as soon as possible. It seems that's about it though, right? Yeah. Alrighty, so now let's start looking at M16s and even M24s because, uh, really no really use for all of these, essentially. Sell one of these charge rifles. So look at that, 3200 left. Let's go ahead and sell M24. And they're looking at 21 now, so I could sell two. Where are the thousand variety? M16, definitely, and, um... Let's go with one of these M25, M16 again. Alrighty, so let's go that way. So we're gonna have 61,000, so thank you for that. And Smith, really quickly, open communication one more time. And once more. Good, alrighty. Cancel. Dolly Parton's is fully healed now as well, already good. So these bodies should definitely get started moving down in here, once that's already done with. Um, they're setting up our... A trade ship has nearby. Good, actually. Oh, and another industrial trader. Good, excellent. All right, so, um, Smith, you take your ass back over here and let's uh, trade with this new uh, gentleman cruise ship, known as Ludion Lubricant. <laughs> I could go many ways with that. I wonder what they really specialize in. If you catch my drift, condom jokes and immaturity. Absolutely, that's what my channel thrives on. All right, so we're gonna give them five thousand for more metal, and I'm perfectly fine with that. So now that that's done with, let's see if uh, there's anything we could sell them. And indeed there is. M24s all around, incendiary launchers. I don't really use those that much. Charge rifles, I have quite a few of them. So it doesn't I don't really see myself uh, parting with a few of these. I have quite a few of them, as a matter of fact. And M16, and let's do another M24. Alrighty, that's good. Excellent, thank you, Luderkin. And you know what? Really quickly, Smith, since this seems to be working right now, go ahead and um, communications one more time. And once more, just to be safe, I really want to get into Slave Trader, just because obviously you could increase our people here. You have detected cargo unit, jump to the location, and more metal! Excellent! You know what? Normally don't make hauling a priority just yet, but metal is always good, so definitely pick that up when you guys get the chance. So, we've set up um, our blast charges around the area, or the ones that we use, and I actually set a lot of them up down the pathway, because these motherfuckers like to take my pathway to uh, reach my base. So, you know what? They're going to be in for a rude awakening when they uh, decide to do that next time. Alrighty, so, other than that, um, hauling should be a priority over here to get these bodies out of the way, so, they're not doing that, so let me get in here and, um, Bruce Wayne's still taking care of Molina, good. So, let's say, um, but, but constructing is, uh, no-go at the moment. Don't need that. And repairing, might as well keep it growing, uh, let's call it a quits right now for growing, guys. We have a lot of food, right? It doesn't matter if we lose one, uh, crop. And mining... Well, I do want to mine that area out a bit, but that could wait. I really want to get the hauling out of the way just because it's really bothering me now. Plant cutting, I'm not ordering any plant cutting and cleaning. All right, good. So you go, guys. Uh, 
Let's put you back in fast motion here. All right, everybody, get on over here. Get these bodies out of the way. We'll set them on fire with Kelly or Curry and, uh, you know, keep going our way here. Somebody needs to repair that as well. Thank you, uh, Turner. Well, the male Tina Turner, if I remember correctly. All right, guys, so get those bodies out of the way. Thank you, Pug. All right, guys, good, good, good. Lenny's just running up and down for some reason. All right, guys, those bodies in there quickly, quickly, and, uh, I guess the uh, normal fashion and whatnot. <laughs> Not really entirely sure what you would call that, you know, like a inopportune fashion, you know, just dragging bodies into a right away of burning and everything. Alrighty, so another industrial trader. This is actually working out quite well for us. So, um, where is Smitto again? Smitty. Smitty? Where have you run off to now, Smit? I always have to goddamn do this. Smit, where the fuck are you? Smit is, uh... Oh, he's eating. You put that food down, Smitty. You don't eat until you've, uh, made some amazing trading for us. And in this case, it means, uh, you know, getting us more metal. We're gonna make, we're gonna make metal a lot, whether it's, uh, you know, mining for it or selling or buying it. It doesn't really matter. So, 646, yes, I will take all that metal as well. Alright, these trade shits have been a godsend recently, so... Let's see. We have more shit to sell, so pistol out of the way. And I saw another pistol... Pistol, pistol, and pistol. Oh, I saw Leon Field somewhere around here as well. Tough cocktails. Uh, let's keep one of the. Actually, no. I think we have enough cocktails. That's what she said. As she's a, uh, you know, struggling alcoholic and everything. Our charge four rifle and another one of those and M24. Charge rifle, charge rifle. Charge rifle, and might as well fucking sell that one too. Alright, there we go. Thank you guys. And Smid, because it's been working out so well, do another uh, open communication. You never know what might happen here. Smid, don't you fucking run off so fast, right? You know the drill, it's three. Three, Smid. Good. Alright, you can run off now and do whatever you need to do. Alright, those bodies are being moved appropriately, and... So, make sure to pick those weapons up as well so we can sell them. Man, there's a lot of fucking bodies this time around. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Alrighty. Come on, guys. Keep doing your thing there. Get those bodies out of the way. I want every- I want- I want a body in everybody's arms, essentially, what I'm trying to get at here. Primarily, uh, dead than alive. I don't want to have you guys tossing yourselves into the incinerator room now. I know Dolly Parton's liable to do that since she doesn't get along with too many people. But at least she's taking a dead body there, it seems. Yeah, it is. Alright. Good on you, Dolly. That's a lot of fucking... That was a huge raid. God damn, I'm about to fill that area up and there's still, like, so many littered bodies around. It's a clusterfuck of bodies up here as well. Jesus. Alrighty, guys. Come on. Speed it up a bit. Forget about hauling the metal right now. I just need the bodies out of the way. Molina is no longer incapacitated, so welcome back, Molina. We could definitely use your uh, manly hands here. Your strong, delicate manly hands, I should say, to kind of uh, mold these bodies out of the way and essentially commit some sort of, uh, I don't know. I'm not entirely sure what, like, cremation, I suppose. I guess cremation's correct. I feel always awkward when I'm burning these bodies. I feel like, you know, <laughs> it's just uh, really unsettling, essentially, what we're doing here. All right, so there's at least... Six, seven more to haul. Do I have enough room for them? I should have enough room for them there. Alrighty. Won't be able to do it through uh, this run, though, unfortunately. Smith's back into works here. Smith, can you uh, forget the weapons? Yeah, bodies is primarily important just to get them out of the way. Uh, the metal back here hasn't been picked up yet, which isn't a big deal, as a matter of fact. Moon has orbited and Eclipse has begun. That's fine. Alrighty. So they're backing up and ready to go, Bruce. Forget about the metal for the moment, Bruce. I'd rather just get the bodies out of the way. This is going to be kind of a pain in the ass, because I, I get the feeling that now we're also going to have a lot of more, um... Where are you going, Molina? Molina, where are you going? I guess fix that. I feel like we're going to have a lot... Soldier needs a break? Oh, shit. Oh, my bad, Nox. Uh, <laughs> go go eat and sleep. Jesus, my, my mistake, man. I forgot you were still militarized for some reason. Wow. <laughs> Good thing that a man just didn't die of starvation just standing there. All right, so yeah, this uh, the whole b body burning process is going to feel like it's going to get more difficult by as time goes because we're going to have bigger raids. So that means it's going to be like, look at this. This is all from that raid alone. Jesus. 
So as you can imagine, it's going to be a lot more difficult to kind of like, you know, clear these bodies out by the time of the next raid, unfortunately. So now what we're going to do here is, uh, Kelly, you bring your assassin ass on over here. And before you do that, though, let's cock... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, we do have one more cocktail. <laughs> For a second there, I was worried. I was going like, oh shit, I sold my cocktails. How am I supposed to burn these things on fire now? I suppose I could just lay some blast charges in there, but... It seems rather inopportune. So, Kelly, get down over here, and we'll have you set body to the, uh, not set body, but set fire to those things. Now that that's all been moved out, let's go ahead and equip my priorities once again to mining and all the good stuff. Growing and whatnot. And now, hopefully, we can start focusing on the mining of that area right there for a little bit more metal. I know that I've recently, uh, forgone this area now. I've been doing a lot of work out here, but I kind of want to really set this area up before we start moving back over here. I mean, for a while, I just focused on this area, so um, I, I kind of want to give ample time to both sides, you know. So that's the reason why we haven't been doing much in there at the moment. So hopefully, they start mining out over here. We'll extend that area for a bit more batteries as well. So now that Kelly's down here, let's go ahead and have her shoot some, uh, some sweet Molotov cocktails in there. Set everybody ablaze. You want to get a little bit closer in there, Kelly? Set another one off over there. If you could land a few back here, that'd be great. And set one off in there. What do we have here? Raiders that landed nearby. Alrighty. So, something to definitely look. See, this, this is gonna happen. Like, I feel like I'm gonna be like fucking setting fire to all these bodies, and then the Rex Ray's gonna come. I'm gonna have to haul like 70 different bodies to get in there. It's an hassle. Alrighty, and they're all the way back over here. It seems like a smaller crowd than the last raid, though. That is definitely for sure. So, at least that's one part. That's one good thing about it. So, Kelly, um, really quickly, I'm gonna have you... Actually, no, no, no. Step back over here really quickly. There is bodies right here that need to be taken care of as well. Oh, those aren't bodies. Those are just rocks. <laughs> All right, my bad. I'm a little bit blinder, apparently. And shoot some in there. Hopefully that starts spreading a bit more. God damn, spread. Spread through those corner bodies, damn it. It should spread, right? Yeah, yeah, one of them caught. All right, they're catching fire now. All right, good. So now, Kelly, let me go ahead and uh, have you unmilitarize. Trade ship has left the comms range. That's fine. So we have all of our blast charges set in place, though, so... On the plus side, that is good. I'm going to have Kelly go back in there and kind of uh, get some food or whatever she needs to do. Make sure to keep an eye out that nobody leaves the uh, settlement and triggers that raid just yet. There's going to be a few bodies left over in there, unfortunately. Local squirrel's gone mad and it will attack anybody it sees. Alrighty, squirrel. Not entirely sure. Maybe you could uh, go attack some raiders for us. We'll see. Yeah, have raiders of land. Oh yeah, we already did that one. So we're just kind of hanging out over here. Chatting about sports or something, you know. That's what you do in RimWorld. I, I would like you to catch fire, too. All right, good. Ah, oh, the water. Pretty much the rain is what took care of that situation there. All right, and the solar flare has begun. Oh, no, that's not good at all. And the raiders have finished their assault as well. All right, so they're coming at me now, so I need to... Uh, all right, guys, you need to... I'm sorry you guys started mining so late. Fortunately, uh, we, need a, we have a raid coming in now, right? So... Everybody go into the barracks. Oh, let me militarize you, and then go into the barracks. And we want uh, Kelly, wherever she might be, asleep. We need you to equip yourself once again with an actual weapon of choice, and R4 will definitely do. Everybody into the barracks, though. And let's see, these guys are coming out this way. Alrighty, so definitely a uh, opportune time to actually start uh, setting up my new, or pretty much setting off some of these new blast charges I set up for the way. So let me start off with this one. Let me put this in real time as well. And might as well start this one off as well. So that worked out pretty well. Alright, so I took off one of them for sure. And a few of them seem to be a little more injured. So if they continue going upwards, there's going to be a few more blast charges. There's not that many over this area. But seeing as they like to cut through as well, I should probably consider putting some blast charges in that area. But for the meantime, though, we need to get these guys ready and to go here. So, Dolly is one of our shooters, so right there. Uh, pirate for sure. Let's see, where is Curry? Curry over here. 
Pug, I believe Pug is a decent shot as well, right? Shooting, yep. So you go over there. Browning, are you a decent shot? You are almost to seven, so you're getting there. So you go over there and... Oh, shit. Should really uh be looking at my blast charges here. Oh, that one could have hurt this guy, but, you know, one blast charge for one guy, definitely not worth it. Alrighty. Let me really quickly... Where are my blast charges set up? Alright. So they're almost walking towards a fucking clusterfuck of a minefield here, so, you know... They're gonna be really regretful once they do. Kelly, now you go over here, and we're gonna have two more spots open here for... Who is it? Lane? Nope. Not Bruce Wayne. Not Smid. It's so Riley. Riley shooting eight, definitely. So you go... No, don't arrest anybody. Just go hang out there. Knox, how are you doing? Shooting a little bit above seven, Kemp. Shooting three. I think Barr is the other guy, right? No, not really. Molina is the guy. Unfortunately, he's hurt and he doesn't have a weapon. I could equip him really quickly, but do I really want to risk it? Not necessarily, so let me just have uh, Riley go and uh, take care of this one. Actually, Riley is going already. Knox, is it? Yeah, let's just have Knox take care of this one. Alright, and Kelly's getting into place, and now let's also look at our minefield. Alrighty, so we're ready to go for sure now. And I guess we could start off with this one, right? Alrighty, that worked out really nicely. Uh, this one, might as well give it a try, see what happens. Oh, this one over here is going to definitely pay off dividends right now. Alrighty. And there's going to be a little crowd coming down there. Oh, no! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. Um, sell. <laughs> oh, shit. That sucks so bad. That really sucks so bad. Alrighty, uh, sell, sell. Oh, man, it's gonna ruin my layout of things, too. Look at that. I had, like, you know, <laughs> I had blast charges everywhere just in case they're gonna escape through all these hides. Oh, shit. That sucks. So after this raid, we're gonna have to be doing a lot of uh, careful blast charge placing again, it seems. Oh, man, that fucking sucks so bad. Can I just... Oh, no, 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 no. Did I just sell the power conduits? I just sold the power conduits too. God, I am such a goddamn imbecile. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Uh, that one's not gonna hit anybody. <laughs> I apologize for this, guys. I'm a fucking imbecile. Oh man, the ones in front of the base are the ones that are gonna really, really hurt, as a matter of fact. Oh shit. You gotta be shitting me right now. I'm actually a little bit worried now. I am quite, quite worried, as a matter of fact. Ugh. Oh. Okay, you need to turn on now, guys. Ugh. Oh. Okay. That's all of them. Now we are pretty much stuck in a hand-to-hand uh, -hand combat situation here. My turrets aren't even on because uh, of the solar flare and the fact that... Uh, <laughs> Sold some conduits over here. Jesus Christ. This is not good. This is not going to be good at all. Oh, man. You know what I feel like actually doing? Bar, really quickly, can you... Um... Uh, it's going to hurt. I know it. it's going to hurt a lot, but... Set up a blast charge. Go and build that really quickly. Oh, he didn't finish fixing it! Oh no, Bart! I thought you were done fixing it! Okay. Alright, stop fighting people. Okay, they're, they're fleeing. <laughs> oh, Bar is fighting. Oh, man. Have I actually survived that? I apologize for the lag in commentary, guys. I, I'm just kind of shitting myself over here. 
Um, really quickly, let's see if we could sell this and uh, get my guys going over here as he tried to flee away. Bar just knocked that. Bar is a fucking monster. Him by himself. He just went into that group like a. <laughs> oh shit! Alrighty. Um, Knox, can you go and melee attack over here? Same with you, Riley. You go and melee attack over here. Dolly, you go and melee attack over here. Oh, my lord. All right, guys, no shooting. No shooting. Pug, you get the fuck in there if you're going to be shooting. No shooting. You guys end up killing yourself by shooting, so don't, don't shoot. All right, that person went down. Nope, Turner, don't do it. Browning, don't do it. Do oh, Dolly, stop it. Turner, stop it. Oh, you guys killed them. You savages. I wanted to capture a few of them. All righty, well, there you go. Jesus Christ, <laughs> that, one, that one really bad. That blast charge thing really fucked me up. Jesus. All righty, guys. Um, how about this? Let's just go ahead and call it an episode here. I apologize with the Silas towards the end of this episode, but I was a little bit kind of terrified it was going to happen. And unfortunately, or fortunately, it didn't go bad. I mean, we didn't lose anybody. But as you can see, uh, this was a really terrible spot as to what happens if you uh, aren't aware of you're highlighting everything. <laughs> Either way, guys, hopefully you enjoyed the episode. I'll catch you next time.